fuck the cute intro. We're not. I'm not doing that much in this. Okay, we're we're gonna make this quick. Bruh, remember when I said that this game would be bad, and people genuinely doubted me? Somebody even said it might be better than the Outlast Trials. So, we're not going to waste any time. Why do you people gas this shit up? I think I asked this before, but, bruh, this looks and seems like they just took Benny and the Ink Machine and just did a different story. The game looks like ass. It plays, from what I've seen, like ass. It plays almost exactly the same. The story sucks. The voice acting sucks. Bruh, did you intend releasing this after Benny and the Ink Machine? This is bad. It's bad. You can look up any clips online. I promise. You will think. Really? This was released in 2022? It doesn't feel like a 2022 game. This feels like it would be released in, like, 2012, during the Five Nights at Freddy's craze, or something. This is bad. It's bad. The, the weapon animations are still janky as fuck. Why? Why do we give these people our fucking money? I didn't play it. Okay, I'm gonna admit it now. I I could be missing a big part, man. You haven't played the game. How can you say it looks bad, dude? Watching the videos, the game looks fucking atrocious. It doesn't look good. The story, from what I understand, isn't fucking good. It do it do doesn't make any sense. Why? Why? Why would you? And and, and there's people defending it in my comments section. I'm not saying fuck you to those people. I get it. They, defend your franchise. I, stick to your guns. Trust me. I, I'm all for it. But uh, I hope you look at the game as it's released. And just think about your decisions. I don't want you to sit there and be like, well, somebody on the internet told me how to think, so this is how I'm going to think. No, don't do that. Don't do that. That is such a dumb fucking thing to do. There are plenty of movies that are, sh like, nationally shit on because people are like, well, on the internet, this guy said it was trash. If you really think about it, every movie is garbage if you find the right video. There's everybody who's made a video on every single movie saying it was trash or it's garbage. No. This game doesn't fall into the category because it's genuinely a bad game, but use your own research to find this out. It's really easy. Just look up a video. I watched a video of somebody essentially decoding one of the boss fights, and they showed the regular boss fight, and it looked like a beta test. The fucking ending battle, the the lighting is so screwed up. There's no There's no alternate lighting. Maybe I saw a weird janky addition. Maybe I saw a genuine beta test. But it looked like someone just popped open Unity map maker and just kind of threw it together. <sighs> like, why? Why do we do this? Don't give your money to developers who don't care about you. These guys don't care about you. They don't. They saw a cash grab, and they fucking made their move. So... When you are buying games in the future, what I want you to do is just do some research on the people who made it. I want you to sit down and think, should I support these developers? These guys are still in a lawsuit because of merch brand deals? I don't know. And I, I thought that was funny as shit because that's, that's the big controversy, not that the game sucked. <laughs> Okay, got it. Almost, like, Benny and Ink Machine, the first one, actually kind of looks better. And I think there's a problem when I'm saying that. Because that game didn't look that good either. It, say all you want. It, it looked like ass, man. I'm sorry. But they have released, like, an objectively just flawed game. I'm not saying it's Hunt Down the Freeman Part 2. I'm not saying it's, like, X32. This is just not a good game. I'm sorry. <laughs> F's in the chat. Well, all my plans for doing reviews uh, has got completely shit on because 
Well, let's let's say a series of unfortunate events has been going on with my recordings, with my torrents, with everything. So I can't really like play the games correctly. I can't do a few of these things. Nightmare House is old as shit, and you know it's not going to record properly, and I can't get OBS to work with it. Uh, I don't know what to do with that, but I don't know. I'll Maybe I'll find a way to get to it. Doom, which I don't think I've talked about. The only downloads I found were in German. Doom Annihilation doesn't even have a download link. And I will be damned if I pay fucking money to make a review about bad movies. Although the first Doom movie is actually not that bad. I, I feel like people really just shit on it a lot. But if you watch it and with a critique brain, you might think, eh, okay, maybe this isn't as bad as people made it out to be. Are the graphics bad? Are the CGI kind of fucking atrocious? Yes. But, actually enjoyable watch. Doom Annihilation, which I don't think I need to explain why that's bad. I watched through that movie, and it is... That movie's ass, man. That's why I wanted to make the review on it. It was really bad. But... That's all I gotta say about that. Alright. Time for me to take another three-month hiatus, right?